A house, as we know it, has devolved from somewhere to live to a traded commodity. Most of us would like to have something for nothing, but the truth is we can't have that. The big issue I see is, is speculation. It's the speculation of investment in the housing market that's driving the price up. Our economic system has been corrupted over time. It does seem amazing that, you know, two people on a reasonable income can't afford to buy a house. Why has the Australian taxation system become so supportive of property speculation? Has it really delivered the investment outcomes we need? So we've never actually bid at an auction. The rents kept going up as well, so it was impossible to save. The system has been twisted to work against our best interests. Classical economics stopped being taught, especially after 1980. They dropped economic history from the academic curriculum. Entrepreneurs have been surpassed by speculators in the capitalist food chain. Today, a free market means an extractive economy in which wealth flows from the bottom of the pyramid to the top of the economic pyramid. Democratic freedom means nothing without economic rights. OK, fine, so be it. I can't buy a house, but I don't want to live in a hole and pay terrible rent for it. This is a clear, clear case of real estate for ransom. Well, it doesn't sound like a free market to me.